Hey guys, Miss Watkins again. I'm going to talk to you just a little bit about your hallway etiquette procedures in the hallway. It will look a little bit differently this year. Um, when you are in the hallway, masks are required, um, so make sure you have your mask on anytime that you're in the hallway. Um, the flow of traffic in the hallway will be pretty simple. It's going to go um, exactly like the cars on the road. So you're always going to stay to your right. So if you are moving in this direction and you're going down the hallway, you're going to stay on the right side. Same thing, you would be against the lockers over here if you were moving in the opposite direction. What we are asking is that you constantly keep the traffic flowing. So you're not going to be able to stop in the hallways and congregate, talk to your friends, or wait on somebody. Um, but we're also asking that you don't pass one another or group up in large groups. So we're going to give you some extra time in the hallway. You're going to have 10 minutes um, as of now in between class changes. So you'll have plenty of time to walk without passing or, or rushing to your next class. Um, and that way you can stay um, on opposite sides, so we'll have some space in between. Uh, make sure you're not holding hands, um, any of that kind of thing that you weren't allowed to do anyway. Um, but that will be the procedures in the hallway. As far as, uh, we'll also ask teachers to help us with dismissal. So if you have a class of 25 students, um, and it's time for class to dismiss and the bell has rang, They'll be at their, it will be at the teacher's discretion if they want to hold you just a, a few seconds so that the hallways can kind of clear so that way you can safely enter in the hallway. Thank you.